An explosion rocked this train station in Urumqi, the capital of Xinjiang province in China, on Wednesday evening. These pictures posted on Weibo show the aftermath with scattered luggage and in this one what appears to be people lying on the floor. At least 50 people were reported injured. Xinjiang has been rocked by violence between its native Uyghur population and ethnic Chinese settlers. Significantly, the explosion occurred shortly after Chinese leader Xi Jinping toured the region. He told local police that they were what he called the fists and sharp knives of the country. She told China he'd resolutely crack down on terrorism and separatism with high intensity. Thailand's election commission told Prime Minister Ying Lung Shinawat to call new elections for July 20th. The opposition movement vowed that this time they'd drive her from power through the ballot. But analysts say it's likely Ying Lux party will win again and the election will do nothing to heal Thailand's deep political divisions. South Korea's Coast Guard has apologized for its slow response to the April 16th ferry boat disaster. There's been criticism that Coast Guardsmen wasted critical minutes after they've heard the first SOS messages from the vessel. Meantime, the search of the sunken ferry continues. So far, divers have found 212 bodies. More than 90 people are still missing. Hi, I'm Tui Vu, the host of Link Asia. Catch Link Asia every Friday on Link TV, 9.30 p.m. Eastern, 6.30 p.m. Pacific. Check our website for local listings on KCET Los Angeles and PBS's The World Channel.